Maitland police say it was North Lake Destiny Road, the Sheraton Hotel, where authorities were dispatched and found an unresponsive man. They confirmed to West Chew News that man was Nick Gordon, who was pronounced dead at a nearby hospital in Seminole County. Gordon was the ex-boyfriend of Bobby Christina Brown, daughter of Whitney Houston and Bobby Brown. While the circumstances of his death have not yet been released, we spoke with those who knew Gordon. Attorney Randy Kessler, who represented him several years ago. He was never in a good place. You know, the whole world was against him. His life was already shattered by losing her, losing Whitney. And then nobody had any sympathy for him because everybody wanted to blame somebody. So they all pointed the finger at him. Gordon's attorney, Joe Hibachi, sending us a statement saying in part, Despite all of the incredible challenges Nick faced over the last few years, I can honestly say that he worked hard to hold his head up and stay sober. My heart goes out to the family and friends Nick leaves behind and to any other families dealing with the losses and heartache caused by drugs. Mr. Gordon, good morning. Central Florida has seen Gordon before. Back in 2017, he was arrested at his Sanford apartment complex after he was accused of hitting his then girlfriend. Before that, Gordon had been found legally responsible in the 2015 death of Bobby Christina Brown. This closes the chapter and that he's allowed to rest in peace and people move on from pointing the finger at him. I mean, we all have to move on and, you know, we wish he was still here. We wish Bobby Christina, we wish Whitney was still here, but, you know, it's not the way life had it for them. The medical examiner's office out of Leesburg, they told me they did an autopsy on Gordon this morning. They have further tests, though. Those results are pending tests like toxicology. They say that could take three to six weeks. We're live in Maitland, Paul Rivera, West News.